hello all welcome back and this video we're going to understand uh, how to use the core modules of node.js so here uh, the very first example is we're going to understand uh, how to use the core module that is uh, os module so what is os module is uh, 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 which is helpful for you to accept or uh, or extract the uh, op uh, your operating system data okay so what is your system memory what is your computer name and what is your ram size and what is the uptime so all the operating system related information you're gonna fetch using the os module so let's see how to use practically uh, os module so first of all uh, we need the server setup for uh, using the os module uh, because i have to display the response on the uh, screen here okay so what I do is, can we do one thing instead of, uh, you know, creating everything from scratch, can I use the same snippet? I'll do one thing. I'll just copy this server creation. I just paste it and because I want the same setup. Okay. So 03 node.js server, uh, let's say core module, core module, uh, OS, OS module, just click of refactor. So it will just create a same copy of the previous project and in this yeah so let me stop the existing server okay and let me start the new one what is this uh, my core module file right click open terminal so let's say npm start we have already done the uh, package.json configuration so you can start like this so it's getting started mm. come on yeah it's starting okay so once it is started yeah so once it is started uh, let me import because OS module available with import so import OS from OS okay if you want to know more about OS module go to official documentation where you can find uh, where you can find uh, is OS dude Yahoo is here you can find okay so you have functions like free memory home directory host name platform release like too many things okay so let's start okay so here uh, OS module um, I say something called it OS data is equal to an object okay so instead of calling one by one function I just create instead an object so let's say total memory so what is total memory how can you access the total memory of your system is OS dot total memory and if you want to access the free memory OS dot free memory okay and if you want to access the home directory that will be OS dot home directory okay and if you want to access your computer name uh, that will be ha uh, host name uh, host name is not that host name let's say like this computer name OS dot host name host name okay so like this and you got this OS data and I want to print this on my screen. So what I response is, uh, let me come in this response. Let's make a fresh response. So respond dot end uh, in this. I use a backtick, a pre tag. Okay, so in this I use my OS data. Okay, this OS data I'm gonna respond back okay fine so this is how you can fetch os dot uh, function call it's very very simple module so let's see how to get this you just need to send a request for this url okay so uh, your server is already running okay let's go to insomnia and send a request you got actually an object but i want to see the real data mm, can we do one thing instead of this let's say let's convert into string format uh, os data 
So if I say JSON dot stringify, so JSON is not a Node.js thing. It is a, uh, it's a simple JavaScript object. Okay, every JavaScript object is available in Node except Windows and Document. Okay, so JSON dot stringify this one. So this will convert to a string format. Now let me and please also check my server has started again because of Node.mon and let's go here and click on send a request see you got data see total memory 12 some number I'm using actually 12 GB RAM so it, it's showing in bytes and uh, free memory how much is free and what is your home directory c colon user slash HP uh, for example you know what is home directory right see when I open a command prompt by default it opens a certain directory location that is your home directory and uh, your computer name this one desktop q and something this is your computer name and where can you uh, find this name is you can just go to your pc right click properties and here you can find actually this one see desktop q and put something okay so i got that okay it means the os module is specifically uh, designed to extract the os related information through your node.js program okay so you also have a lot of other functions so you can just have a try so what is mean by the load average and what is the platform platform means the windows platform or linux platform or mac uh, like that so you have a lot of other functions and uptime it will give you in seconds how much time uh, when your system was still up and running okay since uh, so like a lot of functions are there uh, so you can just have a try and uh, that's enough for os module and let's see fs module in the next video the file system module in the next video thank you so much for watching and let's meet in the next video thank you mm -hmm.